Welcome to 60 Second Civics, the daily podcast of the Center for Civic Education. I'm Mark Gage. Our system of government is complicated. The framers of the Constitution created a system of separated and shared powers and checks and balances to limit and control the use of power by governmental institutions and to prevent the possibility of tyranny either by the executive branch or by a majority in Congress. Each of the three branches of the government was given the power to check the use of power by the other institutions. Here are some examples. Congress can check the power of the executive branch by a number of means, including by controlling its budget, holding oversight hearings examining how well it is carrying out its responsibilities, overturning a presidential veto, rebuffing presidential nominations to the cabinet and the Supreme Court, and impeaching the president and other governmental officials. The president can check the power of Congress by vetoing the bills it passes and by exerting influence on regulations through executive orders. The Supreme Court can check the power of both other institutions by declaring laws they pass or actions they take to be in violation of the Constitution. That's all for today's podcast, 60 Second Civics, where civic education only takes a minute. 